And while speaking to Northeast Live, Nesso Chairman Samuel Jirva also reiterated the organization's opposition to CAA and demand for ILP. Jirva also spoke on the voting incident. We are joined in by the chairman of NESO, Mr. Samuel Jerovel. Today, the executive council meeting of the NESO was held. So, what were the main resolutions taken in this meeting? Well, in this uh, NESO executive council meeting, we have discussed at length on various issues. And the main issue, apart from education, the Armed Forces Special Powers Act, and also the unemployment problem in the different states of the northeastern region, and also the uh, constitutional safeguards for the uh, indigenous peoples of the northeastern region. We have also discussed the very important point of illegal infiltration in the different states of, of the northeastern region from Bangladesh. Well, on this, uh, on, this, on this issue, we have discussed about the imposition of the CAA, the Citizenship Amendment Act, by the government of India on the indigenous peoples of the northeastern region. Despite our protests, despite a strong opposition, the government of India has imposed this act on us. Also, we are discussing about our demand for the implementation of the inline permit in the different states of the northeastern region. Because as of now, only uh, Nagaland, Arunachal Pradesh and Mizoram and Manipur, uh, in which the ILP is implemented, whereas the states of Meghalaya, Assam and Tripura are left out of the purview of the ILP. And also, the, we are expressing our concern with regard to the presence of the fundamentalist groups in the different states of the Northeast, especially in Assam. And all the, on, on these issues, we, uh, the NESO has decided that we will have a protest, a three hours protest on the 17th of June 2022 to express our dissatisfaction with the government of India with regard to all these issues which is affecting our survival, which is affecting uh, the ethnicity of the indigenous peoples of the northeastern region. Well, the centre is adamant on implementing CAA in the northeast. So what would be your stand right now? Because the centre is saying, Union Home Minister is saying that after the third dose of COVID vaccination is over, the CAA will be implemented. Well, uh, as I said earlier, we are against the implementation of CA and also this shows that the government of India is not sensitive towards the sentiments of the indigenous peoples of the northeastern region. If they go ahead and implement the CA, the NESO and the different component organization, organizations of the NESO, we will have a protest both democratically and also legally on this issue. Well, in the press meet you have also said uh repealing of the Armed Forces Special Powers Act from the entire Northeast and you have brought in the special case of the voting firing incident where the massacre took place, where the special para forces were involved. So right now the Supreme Court has given a stay on the prosecution of all the para uh, troopers who were involved in that massacre. So what would you say on it? Uh, well, you see, it's, it was very unfortunate that the voting massacre happened. It's just one of the happenings that has happened in the different states or northeastern region since the implementation of the AFSPA. And the government of India has not given its go-ahead to prosecute these army personnel who are involved in the massacre of these innocent people at Uting. And this goes, goes on to show that this is another injustice meted out to the Indian peoples of the northeastern region. And this will only further alienate the indigenous peoples of the northeast region further from the mainstream or the mainland India. So what would be NESO's stand in this regard? Well, as I have said earlier, NESO will have a movement if the government of India implements a CA, both democratically on the streets and also legally in the courts. Of SPA, we have been demanding that it should be repealed, it should be uh, withdrawn from the whole of northeastern region, even though its operation has been reduced, but still we feel that AFSPA should be totally withdrawn from the whole of the northeastern region. Thank you very much. That was the chairman of NESO, Mr. Samuel Jirwa, talking exclusively to Northeast Life. Reporting from Guwahati, this is Arindam Das for Northeast Life.